Howdy, this is Edward from Valarm. You'll see in this video how to use Valarm Tools Cloud's 3D mapping feature so you can visualize and analyze your industrial IoT sensor information in three dimensions. We've implemented 3D into tools.valarm.net using Esri ArcGIS Earth as you're watching in these clips. Now let's learn how to do this with your Valarm remote monitoring deployments. First, you'll log in to your Valarm Tools Cloud account on tools.valarm.net. After you've logged in, click the 3D GIS tab in the top menu, and you'll see the Earth globe, just like you're viewing here. Click and drag with the left mouse button to pan around the map, or click to pop up more info on a GPS tagged Valarm sensor measurement. Scroll with the wheel button to zoom in and out continuously, or hold down the middle mouse button and drag to zoom. Click and hold the right mouse button and drag to tilt your view or rotate around the location you've clicked. Click the compass in the upper left or type the letter N on your keyboard to reset north and orient the view with north straight up. To show your Valarm sensor data on the 3D map, select which devices you want to visualize. Then select a from and to date range. Under the 3D Visualization Tools menu, you'll customize how you visualize your industrial IoT information. You can set which sensor parameter corresponds to the height of each Valarm sensor measurement, as well as which sensor field or column changes the colors of each data collection point. In this example, we'll use the Calc3 sensor field for the heights of the features, which in this case corresponds to air quality particulate matter measurements from an AlphaSense OPC N2 sensor that we deployed with South Coast AQMD, the California government agency responsible for air quality monitoring and compliance in Southern California. The sensor is monitoring and measuring PM1, PM2.5, and PM10 air quality readings. For configuring the heights, you'll set the low and high values that make sense for your sensor readings, as well as what height you want min and max values to be. Play around with these until you find the values that work best for you. Next up is the color configuration. Here we'll use the Valarm sensor field for humidity. Set the min and max colors you'd like. Then enter the values that correspond to your sensor's minimum and maximum values. Now we've configured a Valarm device with two separate sensors to visualize at the same time on the 3D Earth globe. This will let us quickly and easily analyze correlations between the two different sensor fields. You can also choose the geometry and which shape you'd like to use for each Valarm data point. You've got the choice of cylinder, cube, or cone. Change the base diameter to make the sensor features more or less thick. Now you've got a beautiful visualization in 3D of two different GPS tagged sensors that were recorded at the same point in time. In the upper right, you can click the base map button to change the base map to a satellite hybrid view, a dark gray base map, terrain, national geographic, or streets. Left mouse click any of your Valarm sensor readings to get a pop-up window with the exact sensor measurements that your Valarm device is reported. In this case, you can see the precise values for PM10 reported by the optical particle counter sensor, as well as the relative humidity percentage. That's an overview of how you can use the Valarm Tools Cloud 3D mapping feature. Log in to tools.valarm.net and try it with your sensor hubs from shop.valarm.net. Thank you for watching, and please don't hesitate to contact us if you've got any questions at infovalarm.net. At